Good morning, Agent Jess. I'm Brandy. And I'm Carson. And here's your news for today. Who's who club pictures and a senior picture on the football field will be taken tomorrow. If you are a junior and interested in the girls' state, please see Ms. Watson and his staff. Next week is Red Ribbon Week. Our dress of days are Monday, wake up drug free, wear pajamas. Tuesday, from head to toe, I'm drug free, crazy hair and socks. Wednesday, ready to say no to drugs, wear red. Thursday, drugs can't find us, wear camouflage. Friday, don't be tricked, drugs are no treat, wear Halloween costumes. Freshmen who's who are most studious, Abigail Hernandez and Colt Tubbs. Most handsome and beautiful, Brett Davis and Jocelyn Chagoya. Best dressed, Jemiah Crosby and Landon Harris. Biggest procrastinator, Yamalet Vargas and Raul Amescua. Oliver Seha and Damian Mondragon. Best smile, Jocelyn Chagoya and Caden Thomas. Class flirt, Mary Emma Hammond and Trapper Tippin. Best personality, Aaliyah Smith and Landon Harris. Most, most athletic, Caden Thomas and Caroline Acock. Class clown, Aaliyah Smith and Kyron Holmes. Most creative, Callie Chavis, Shelby Castro, and Caden Goodwin. Most outgoing, Caroline Acock and Damian Mondragon. Most likely to be on Broadway, Anne Marie Sabatini and Xavier Collins. Sophomore who's who are most handsome and beautiful, Natalie Breedlove, Alberto Aguilar, and Kevion Duckery. Best dressed, Evan Irwin, Kaylee Soto, Kiabion Brown. Biggest procrastinator, Justice Brewer and Aaron Brown. Best smile, Evan Irwin and Jose Ramos. Class flirt, Natalie Breedlove and Nikhil Lewis. Best personality, Nyla Black and Aaron Brown. Most athletic, Carson Thomas and Nikhil Lewis. Class clown, Justin Bre Justice Brewer and Cameron Ray. Most creative, Nala Black and Kyle Carpenter. Most studious, Mabur Davis and Trung Gwynn. Most outgoing, Carson Thomas and Kevion Duckery. Most likely to be on Broadway, Ava Wasner and Brady Kelly. Juniors who's who are Best Driver, Carson Chavis, Dustin Weston, and Maddie Gillum. Most handsome and beautiful, Saxton Brooks and Catherine Crow. Best dressed, Cody Hayes and J.C. Clavette. Biggest procrastinator, Chris Acock and Alejandro Amescua. Best Smile, Saxton Brooks and Catherine Crow. Class Flirt, Anthony Smith and J.C. Clavette. Best Personality, River Amescua and Ella Grace Poole. Most Athletic, Peyton Sellers and Logan McKelvey. Class Clown, Anthony Smith and Makaya Terry. Most Studious, Connor Maxwell and Ella Grace Poole. Most Creative, Matt and Barnes and Grace Abelardo. Most Likely to be on Broadway, Cody Hayes and Maddie Gillum. Who are Best Driver, Georgia Cooley and Larry Page. Biggest glow up, Sloan Tucker and Irvin Gallegos. Biggest procrastinator, David Barron and Ulysses Barron and Brandy Seha. Best smile, Shania Gavin and Caden Carpenter. Class flirt, Eric Carpenter and Amelia Bennett. Best personality, Gabriel Summers and Guadalupe Vargas. Most athletic, Brent Holland and Laney Tippin. Class clown, David Barron and Emily Gill. Most likely to succeed, Henry Austin and Laney Tippin. Most likely to be remembered, Jackson Grubb and Peyton Pennington. Most studious, Jace Hill and Savannah Sibbles. Most creative, Nathan Crow and Addie Nelms. Most likely to be on Broadway, Chris Harmony and Harley Lawrence. Most school spirit, Sloan Tucker and Jackson Grubb. Most beautiful and handsome, Peyton Pennington and Brent Holland. And best dressed, Brent Davis and Ethan Bernal. Most likely to put others first, Ashlyn Amos and Gabriel Summers. Happy birthday to Courtney Pruitt and Justice Ramwater. Have a great day. Today is National Chocolate Cupcake Day. Today is sunny with a high of 76 degrees and a low of 47 degrees. Tomorrow will be sunny with a high of 80 degrees. Today for lunch we'll be having tomato soup, cheese sandwich, pizza, cheeseburger, chicken sandwich, hot turkey and cheese bagel, fries, chipotle barbecue chicken and cheddar wrap, ham and cheese. Wrap. Welcome to the Weekly Word. I am Kyron. And I'm Jocelyn. The winner from last week's drawing is Addison Evelyn. Please see Ms. Burfield and choose your prize. Here's the word of the week, ubiquitous. To better understand ubiquitous, let's break it down. Ubiquity is a root word. It is Latin for omnipresent. The definition of O-U-S is fully, and it also makes the word an objective. So uh, ubiquitous describes something that is everywhere. An example of the word in a sentence is the artist behind Gangnam Style has not figured out what made a song ubiquitous. Remember any student who used the word ubiquitous correctly 
and seeing and emails it to me virtually by the beginning of the third block this Friday will be entered into a drawing for a present. Again, the word is ubiquitous. Hi, seniors. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know that we have another college tour trip coming up on November the 8th to SAU in Magnolia. Just like UAM, this will be like the first 14 kids to sign up um, on my Google form. If you are one of those first 14 kids, then um, I will get you a permission slip to go. Uh, that Google form will be released on Tuesday, October the 24th. So if you can take, take a minute and if you are super interested in SAU, set, set an alarm so you can be one of the first 14. On this trip, we will probably eat, eat lunch somewhere. So you will need some um, lunch money and there is a bookstore. If I'm not mistaken, our next trip is UCA. And so that's coming up sometime in December. Um, if you have any questions, please, please let me know. Uh, thanks. Hey, was that you in here, Joe? Yeah. What do you call a cow with a twitch? What? Beef jerky. <laughs>